Hello everyone, I'm Crypto Rift, and we're back again with another episode of Roki. Last time we left off, we were kind of at a cliffhanger. We were trying to make some potion with the Nanomare Parasite, the Croak Hair, and the Ram Skull. And we had one of those three in, and now we're about to put in the final ingredient, the Nanomare Parasite. So, I believe this gets us some sort of invisibility potion. Or something of that kind. It's bubbling away very nicely. Was that everything? Yes, it was. Let's check the list again. Oh, there's no way that that was everything. Okay. I still need to put a few things. Like what? One out of my parasite. Correct. Oh, shoot. Did I ask for two? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's, that's sad. Okay. Well, let me go figure out what I have to do next. Well, there's one thing right here. Uh, probably something from my journal. A fortune telling stones. Yep, cool. And uh, in case you were wondering, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go through my journal so you can see all my goodies so far. All right, here's all my loot so far. We got snowdrop stem, report card, uh, troll snot, other stuff. Yeah. So enjoy looking at all of this. I think. I mean, there's clearly some stuff that I missed, but I mean overall, I think I've been doing pretty good so far. All right, now we gotta actually go and look around. Look for clues and sleuth around. So, what do we got in inventory that we can do stuff with? We got those two stone tablets, a knife, a shovel, and this stone thing, which we got from the knock-in. So, it says a stone block. It's got some interesting markings on it. Okay, so I don't really know of any other place that has markings like that. So, uh, let's go around and just explore, and I'll come back to you whenever I find something. We're going to talk to the great old tree and see if he has anything good to say. What have you got for me? Hey, old tree. Hey, young Tove. Yes. I found a troll. Um, I found a few trolls. Oh, one that's not moving. It's turned to stone. The old trolls. Theirs is a sad tale. Long ago, the forest was busy with troll folk. Over time, the males each went on a quest for glory, and each became lonely and slowly turned to stone. So that's why. Why couldn't they just stay together? We saw them go, but we could do nothing to help. The females remain, but their numbers fall too as the seasons pass. So, okay, so we have trolls, but there's no way to revive them, I don't think, right? Okie dokie, I did a little exploration and I went back through some of my old footage. Of course, I edited all the videos, so I kind of already did that, but I could not remember any specific instance where there was something that I could do. I felt like I did everything. So that's why I was kind of confused why I still had another parasite left. But then I remembered that there was this still. I went and looked online. Okay, I, I cheated a little bit. And I saw what we have to do next. That's all I looked up. And what I saw was that there's this bell up here and we have a knife. So now we could drop the bell and that would break the ground or something. So we're going to try to do that and, uh, and use the knife on this. I don't know why I didn't think to do this earlier, but... It never said, like, I could break it, or else I probably would have made a mental note. Alright, gently now. Sorry, Belle, you won't get the ring again. Well, I mean, no one was really using it anyway, so... I see this as an absolute win. Oh. Ooh-wee! That is loud. Okay. Mr. Bell, what are you gonna have to do for me? Bell ringer, okay. Is there a big old hole in the ground, or is this, uh, opened up? Oh, it has opened up. Okay, let's see what's down there. Ooh, fun. Oh, what? What is this, please? A crypt. Ooh, that means dead people are here. Great. All right, we're gonna go inspect these symbols. What do they mean? Well, this looks a lot like this thing that I got, right? Yeah, there's one more that looks like that. Huh, okay. And what have we got over here? Let's inspect. Ooh, it keeps going. Uh, ooh. This is definitely a crypt of some kind. Uh, so old. Ah, spider webs. Great. Oh, this, this doesn't look good. About a hundred years worth of spider webs. Something's behind it. Well, well, well. I have a knife that can be used to get rid of this. I mean, Flame would do the same thing, but I used my last torch on T, so... Can I, can I do anything with it? Can I, oh, 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 it's the stone block. Oh, cool. So that's going to be my last piece of the puzzle. Now let's get this for my journal. 
I see the little thing over here. Oh, it's a little Tante hat. Okay, yeah, it is a nice addition to the journal. Um, does that mean there's dead Tontes? Uh, I don't like the idea of there being dead gnomes, but we're gonna go back through here. Oh, actually, they had different dots, right? Maybe I can take them out and uh, put them in the right order. I can probably do that, right? All right, last one, number four. Is that gonna get us anywhere? Does it open sesame? No. Is there a code somewhere that I have to that I have to follow? That is a specific. I have stone discs, right? Can I use stone discs on anything? On the moon? No. Uh huh. Okay, we we'll have to do a little more exploration to figure out what those dots mean. Hmm, okay, I'm remembering. There are symbols on these things up here in the church, and they have dates on them. A symbol of the sun. Oh, maybe, hold on. Maybe this does not refer to the dots. Uh, oh wait, no. There's a moon. Oh shoot! The moon symbol. One, six, two, three! Oh, that's probably the order, right? Carl Carlson? Because I remember there was a moon symbol down there. Okay. Well, let's try that. One, six, two, three. One, six, two, three. That's the final one. So, yes. Oh, that did work. Oh, I'm pretty smart. I have to give myself props for that one. Oh, are his eyes glowing? Spooky, spooky, spooky. The secret code attached to the date. Awesome. So, can I go down? Um, oh, yep. It's a staircase. Cool. I might have missed something in that little candle room, but... Oh. Sounds like a little, uh, little band. Hello. Oh! <gasps> the bear! Oh, is this where the bear is? It reminds me of the night sky. What's it for the... Well, well, well. Don't I have finally a use for these? Yes, okay. I just have to put it in the right one. Got it. Uh, okay. So I have this one. Does that go on the end? Okay, it does. Cool. So that means there are still two more discs, although... Okay, I'll just take it out and put it on the top one in the top right, correct? Top right you go. There we are. Okay, so all I need is one more disc. Maybe there's one around here somewhere. All right, I'm back here again, and apparently, yes! Apparently you can go right. I, for some reason, did not think to do that. So, cool, who were these people? I don't know. And they don't care. Must they are significant. There it is! Stone disc. Oh my goodness. Yes. That's the last one we need. I wonder what life was like back then. Nope. All I cared about was the disc. Let's go and figure that thing out. Alrighty, stone disc. You are my last one, my last refuge, and my last child. You will be placed into the altar. Uh... Or not. Oh. These two don't look right. Let me... Let me sw swap those do hickeys. There we go. Oh, we did it. Oh, snap. Is the bear statue going to come down? Oh, we're going to go down. Okay, this must be the way in. Well, no going back now. We're committed. What in the uh, I did not expect this. This is cool. A huge underground. I don't really know what this is. Something. Whoa. Uh, oh, what's this on the wall? Uh, looks like parasites or something. Are they Natomare parasites? Can I take them and eat them? I don't want to eat them. Actually, do I want to have another PTSD flashback? <sighs> Probably not. I'm not so keen on those. I felt that felt like that was kind of a big detour. All we learned was that um, Tobey has repressed memories of her mom for some reason. So, oh. There he is, the bear. Oh, there's another Natomare parasite. That actually, that felt surprisingly easy to get to the bear compared to the wolf. There was a lot more stuff I had to go through. I feel like, oh great, another uh, another horn too. Amazing. Jotun Bjorn, dun 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 dun, we have made it. Let's go honk this horn. Honk honk, honk honk. Uh, it doesn't matter. Oh, what? So I can't get it. You're not getting closer until it's cleaned up. Well, we can just cut it away. Yeah. Okay, that works. Cool. All cleaned up. Now let's go honk this thing. Honk, honk, honk the horn. 
Yeah, hopefully not out of breath. You didn't really climb anything this time. And you should know how it works. There. First try. I am proud of you, Tove. You have learned from your mistakes. Is the bear still sleeping? He's still sleeping. Maybe he's in hibernation. This sleep is called hibernation. Uh, is someone there? No. Is it Rorka? Oh no. You're watched every step. Yikes! By who? The trees? I guess the roots can come down here. Oh, oh, the trees don't have many eyes that we do. Oh, it's Rorka talking through the ravens. Oh, uh, oh, or not. Widow Drow is my name, and I know yours, Tove. Okay. Uh, I usually don't eat human children. Troll food, disgusting. But the ravens don't eat my children. Ah, the friend of my friend is my enemy. So, we're gonna. Oh, did you just say I'm an exception? Why? But why? Oh no. Oh, is this an obligatory cutscene? Oh, it is. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have to fast forward through this again. Oh no. Lars and Roki are the same size. Maybe Roki is turning into a child of some kind. Oh no. What is Roki eating too? Ew, those look like rotten pears. Ooh, Roki is terrifying. Oh, and clearly uh, Rorka was taking a toll. Oh, can Roki talk now? That would be a fun turn of events. Why is Rorka forcing me to eat like a southern mom? Her head did that weird thing again. I don't like that at all. Another rare raven, bearing news of afar. Probably about Tobe, saying that she died. But she has not. Uh, our little friend. So maybe she is friends with the Widow Drow or something like that? It reminds me of the Drow race that um, is in Dungeons and Dragons, which I'm a big fan of. They do not help those who are different. No matter their need. What are you trying to say about humans? That humans only help their own kind? Well, I see an exception. Lars is helping Roki. Against his will, true, but still. An eternity of nightmares is fair punishment for what they did to us. Wow. Well, I guess trapping you in a realm against your will, probably not the way to go. My sympathies, she was an intriguing girl. I wonder, did she know her brother was touched by magic? Hmm. I guess Roki can take some of the food? Maybe pass it? Here, eat some. I promise it's not fermented and disgusting. Uh, oh. Ew. Lars, my name is Lars. You've never told Roki your name? Her, Lars. Roki can talk now, wow. I just don't want Roki to turn into Lars, or Lars to turn into Roki, because, you know, they're both kind of chill dudes, just living in different worlds, you know? Roki, don't make this harder than it needs to be. You know, this is the only way you'll be accepted. Well, you see, when you start using superlatives like only, you know you're probably the evil one in this situation. All I wanted was a family. You can get one, just ask for forgiveness. Ooh. Don't want change. Roki, why don't you want change? There was another way. But there is not. Yes, there is another way. Clearly, you think you are defined by your ways and by your past. This is simply not the case. Uh oh what's happening? Time grows short. We must complete the right while we have strength. Another ritual. I don't know why there are beacons all the time and what they mean, but strange. And we're back to normal. Okay. So we've got... Oh my. Tove's... Ooh, what is that? Is that a, uh... What are they called? One of those little gnomes next to me? The Tomte! You're in the crystal kingdom of the Tomte. But if you mean your predicament... Okay, the spider. You're with hers now. With all of us, Cave Tomte. She feasts on us as we once fell into her treasure. Uh-oh. Not a good look. Not a good look. I'll have a dagger. I'll cut us three. Oh, no. The widow took my dagger from me. Come on. Okay. Can I swing back and forth? I... I hope I can actually do that. Tiny Tante Lars, all alone with that thing. I can't rescue you now, it's over. No, don't give up. Who's this Tante child? He's my little brother. Well, plot twist, I actually am your little brother. <laughs> you have a Tante brother you wish. Uh, well, not technically, but, uh, yeah. Family of humans who revere the Tante. Yes, a treasure more rare than diamonds of this cave. You must save him, Tante sister. <gasps> Child, listen, she fears the light. Uh, well, do I have that light? This is the crystal kingdom of Atomte. I used to reflect sunlight so beautifully. Am I talking with a mouthful of you? Okay, uh, what do we do? Do we just swing back and forth? I can't do anything yet. Oh, Atomte will help. Release the light. Release the light. I'll make a feast of both of you. Uh-oh, we give me a rare treasure of this tale. Uh, Yiki, I have a little magic to repay you. Oh, is the light? Uh oh. Actually, I don't know if I want to fall or not. Cause, uh oh, is she falling? Oh no! Um. Oh shoot, my dagger's all the way up there too. 
Uh oh. Okay, well I'm out. A cocoon broke my fall. Nice. Tomte, I hope you'll be okay. Mm. Uh oh. There's no escape for you, human. Well, that's where you're wrong, my dear. Haha, <laughs> your turn to run. Run from a tiny unarmed girl child? Well, you see, I'm not unarmed. I actually. Okay, uh, I am unarmed, so. Huh. Mirror. Huh? Hooks, maybe it's attached to the wall. Yeah, let me do that real quick. This this shouldn't be too hard. Let me, uh, let me just. Literally, the widow is not doing anything. She's just waiting to be hurt. Wowee, that's bright. All right, it was your turn to run, and you chose not to. We're gonna go over here now, and is this a bracket for one of the mirrors? Okay, so there's another mirror somewhere, another bracket. Ooh, what's this? Let's get this thing open. Oh, light. Oh, cool. Uh, look at that, twice as bright. It really does sparkle now. I will toy with you when you eat me. Well, you know, for now, we're gonna give you all the all the loving we can. There's a mirror. Cool. Let's take you. And can we just can we just jump down the hole? No, we can't. Even though that makes sense. Oh, great! We gotta cr climb back down this thing. Okie dokie. That's another bracket. Uh, how do we? How do we shine up? Is there... I can take this. Such a clumsy morsel. Well, actually, that's where you're wrong. I'm actually... Okay, yeah, I'm pretty dumb. Uh, but we're gonna try to... What can we do? Let's put the one mirror. Uh... So, what options we got? We got two bad options. One face is down and to the right, other face is down and to the left. How do we take care of this? What I need is a mirror that faces up because then I would be able to- Oh, I can climb these. Hold on. Is this my doom? Am I dead? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go back down. Let's try to use both these lights to get the widow to go away and then we can try to maybe take another light from somewhere else and then redirect it down below. All right, cool. She retreated up a little farther. So let's climb up here and see what we can do. And open sesame. The light. Oh, shoot. Actually, there is no light. Uh, we're going to go off to the side here and open this because I see no reason not to. Is that light? No, it's not. Okay, just another place to... We're going to go down and then we're going to go right. Okay, we're here. Oh, great, there's a mirror. Okay, that's what I wanted. Oh, and it faces up, too, even better. So we're gonna take that, and we're gonna go back down where we were. Okay, with our first light, we're gonna redirect it this way to go straight up, and then we can go up to the top, and then we can redirect it uh, to the side, and maybe she'll get trapped in the light. That would be fun. But na 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 I'll come get you, Tiny Tom Day. You have nothing to worry about. Here we are. Shatter her. Yes, she's stuck in the light. Ooh, she did not like that. Your demise is inevitable. All right, Tomte, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. Let's cut him down. Oh, I forgot, I don't actually have a rope. Uh, I'll help you down as soon as I can. Uh, shoot, okay, can I keep going this way? Oh, I can. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Do you have anything for me at all? A bracket for one of the mirrors. Uh, um, okay. Ooh, I forgot. There's actually this one that I can use. Great. So now I can, now I should be able to take the, take the mirrors off of the ones on the left. And then I'll be able to repurpose them for the, use them down below. There we are. The one thing I don't like about this is how long it takes to climb these things because the animation is not slow. Just to give you a sense, I'm I'm just gonna sit through it so you can see. There. So it's like that, but for all of the rock climbing. Okie dokie, we're back up here. So I don't know where to shine down below. Can I jump down? Of course I can't. We're gonna have to go back down and figure this thing out. Okay, I hope this is the right reflector. Back up you go. Please work. 
No, it did not. Okay, we're gonna try the other one. Is this gonna work? No. What's the issue? Is it? Okay, let me let me go up here and see what the issue is. Okay, so I was right the first time. Uh, I think the problem, however, is that there is a hatch to the right that I have not opened yet. So I'm gonna do that. That's gonna take me a solid five minutes with the pace we've been going at. Okay, we're at the hatch. Thank goodness. Now we can open it and we can try what we did before all over again. Let's put mirror number one down here. Ba -ba 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 -ba. That one's good. And mirror number two. Thank goodness that took uh, three to four minutes. Yeah. Wow. Now we should have enough light to get to our sword, perhaps? I hope. Uh, okay. Hmm, okay, so maybe not. I guess we have to go down to the right. So, can't get to our dagger quite yet. We have to dwell on this, uh, this lovely little puzzle for a little bit longer, I guess. So, we've got an yet another thing here. Oh, I could probably, uh, there's a light down there that I have activated that can probably disactivate. That's a word, right? Deactivate. That's what I meant to say. This light right here that I'm coming by, we can deactivate this bad boy. So let's come over here and uh, take this guy back. There we are. Yoink. All right. With the power of the lights combined, you shall face my wrath. And now with the two of them. Oh, snap. Ha 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 Okay. Now we should be able to get to our dagger, correct? Correct. All right. Let's get this thing. Now we have all my st Oh, that's all my stuff? I don't think a direct attack will work. Let's need to be smart about this. Yeah, let's get the Tomte down first because that's that's top priority. Ooh, actually, wait, hold on. There's a hatch up here. I think I'm gonna have to open this first before we do anything. Oh, is that is this light, actually? Won't budge with this web shut. Okay, well, I have a dagger now, so let's try it on that. Ah, good. Is that light? I wonder. That'd be useful. Oh, yes! Ha ha ha! You have been owned! Oh no! The Tomte! No! No! Why did you cut down the Tomte? Oh, let me go get you! Alright, Tomte, I've come for you! Be free, my, my sir! Allow me! Huzzah! Welcome to the land of the living! Uh, oh, he looks like a little miner guy with a little miner hat! He's free! Enjoy your life. Oh, here he is, little Tomte. Okay. Hello. Uh, what do you have to say? What is this? Uh, little Tomte, my body's kind of blocking you, but all right. You defeated her. Chief Tomte, our kind would be ever in your debt. <laughs> it's you, and you're okay. Thank you. I've never gotten free if it weren't for you, and we would not be free if it weren't for you, my child. How can we repay your strength and kindness? Yeah, um... <laughs> I need a way out of here. Yes, we can try. Please stand on the stone here. Well, hold on. Let me let me cut down your other friend first. Because that is more important to me than just getting out. I need to actually, you know, help the top days because they have helped me. If it weren't for the light, uh, I don't know where I would be. Actually, I know where I'd be. I'd be in uh, in that spider's digestive system. Tom day is alright. Okie dokie, we're gonna go right also, because I feel like there is something off to the right, and I just want to explore every nook and cranny and make sure I get everything, you know? Okay, it ain't giving me the option to go right, so I guess that was all I had to do, was just pull the dagger. So, let's stand on that stone. Oh shoot, there's actually an up. Uh, I guess we go up. Maybe there is something up here. Oh, it's another Tomte. I'm glad I did this. Okay, I will cut you down. All of your friends will be very happy that I did this because why would they let a little girl come down here and save her and then ask her not to cut down your friends? Maybe they're not friends. Maybe they're just acquaintances by necessity. All right, the gang's all here. Let's stand on the plate. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Do I go up? I'm on the stone. Now what? We can make it fly. Ooh. All right, I'll take it. It's not working. This power is greatest when combined. Oh, what? Is this not all of them? 
Maybe I have to talk to... Hey! I have to talk to them all to activate them? I do have to talk to all of them to activate them because this game loves dialogue and I need to talk to every individual one of these frickers <laughs> pardon my pardon my French to get, to get up oh my goodness let's do this thing uh, we are grateful to you I will never forget you oh trust me I won't set me up Woo oh we made it back to the bear Wow, that was a large detour. I hope we don't take a second detour with an Atomair Parasite. Yowie. Oh my gosh. Now wake this guardian. Did we? Oh, you fool. It will be painless. Come to me. Uh, can we, can we slice, slice and dice? Maybe if I just wake up the bear, I can, uh, I can make this thing go away. Doesn't seem to be getting anywhere. Blow it! Boo! Oh, there's a hole in the wall. Strange. Yes! No! The guardian is never returning. No! He is returning. The bear has awoken! Oh! Yum! I bet he- I bet she tasted pretty good. You didn't I thought the spider plagued only my dreams. Uh, you're awake! Um, fun. Thank you. Uh, I'm just little girl. Uh, I just, I just want to be loved. Bear Rouser. Amazing. Well, we're gonna see if we're gonna take a detour on a, on a lovely trip to PTSD Town, uh, in the next episode. So thank you all for coming to another episode of Roki, and I'll see you all tomorrow.